This literally is now starting number three. I've not done anything. I've literally put the control down yesterday and we're picking up where we left off with the first gummy ship mission. Oh, 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 okay. Okay. These are like the um, crystals that I found on the uh, 12, 13, 14, 14. That's it. Okay, so like here. All oh, right, okay, so this just basically gets you there faster. May as well try it. All right, let's see what this battle's about then. Aha, here they are. This is actually, like, I've only done this for about 10 seconds, but you can definitely tell it's better. And I definitely reckon they're going to have this in number four. Gummy ship that is. Okay. Ah, yeah, so that's the lock on. Okay, I get you. I bet you I'm going to die as well. Nice, okay. All right, rinsing broom, rinsing broom. It'd be good if you actually got good uh, normal XP for your actual characters by doing this. Obviously, you wouldn't because it's a totally different thing, but you know. All right, there's, there's, there's still too many uh, ships in my life. In it. It's a bit overkill. All right, okay. Oh, that was our first battle with a gummy ship. An A, I'm guessing you can get an S rank, but an A, I'll take that. So the best gummy ship would be no gummy ship. Well, <laughs> I mean, I think that's one of the reasons I like Birth by Sleep as well. So much to map, uh, like, navigation on that was really good. I need to go to that green marker, I'm assuming. I mean, I can't really turn around. Oh, you can turn around. Okay. All right, I'm not going to spend all day doing this gummy ship mission because no one wants to see that. I mean, maybe one of you will, but let's try and get to our destination today and actually play the game. Honestly, it's a fun little thing. If you don't know necessary battles, it'd be perfect. I like the open worldness about it, though. Yes, I do like that. Oh, hang on a minute. I didn't expect to be going here. All right, okay, now I'm intrigued. Let's go. Ooh, there it is. The clock tower, shall I say. I reckon this place is going to be massive. I reckon this place is going to be massive. This was quite a big place in number two, really. It was probably one of the bigger areas, I would say. Gorge, we forgot to fill Master Yen Sid in on what happened. Should we go back? Hmm. You mean about Maleficent and Zigbar? No. Look at the shop. The others have already got enough on their plates as it is. Why go stressing them out? The three of us know how to handle a couple of old adversaries, right? Yeah, <laughs> but doesn't that thing Pete said bother you? They should have got new outfits as well. Come on, we're talking about Pete. That means it's probably no big deal. Oh, I don't know. Well, I don't think any of us oh, know, cool. to be honest. The trams are still here. <laughs> I like how he's excited Feels about that like the most. It. Maybe you're feeling what Roxas feels because he misses home. Ah. Actually, I ran into Roxas in the Sleeping Worlds. It was like seeing into his heart for the first time. I can't wish for the biggest thing, too. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. It was a test to see if your data version was ready to face the hurt that you carry inside. Was I ready? I do know Hurt. When I lost Riku and Kairi, and later when I lost the Keyblade, and you guys had to go on without me like that? We're all together now, don't no worry. The one to turn to was the worst kind of Hurt, but that just shows how much you mean to me. Carrying around a little Hurt can't be all that bad. Hurting is part of caring. 
Oh, of course. A bit more clever. Any Sora is still Sora. <laughs> so wait, if Roxas feels something, then we're in the right place. Are we Roxas, gonna go? I'm gonna find you. Are we gonna go Castle Oblivion? Do you seek our liege? Huh? Did you just black out? What Oh! Nobody's. It's been a while. I don't actually activate the, uh, is it the links? Yes, it is. They've got attractions, spirits in this, and then all the stuff on top of that. They've added a hell of a lot. Like, they've added literally everything into one. This controls a lot better than it did in Doom Drop Distance, so. I like how Meow Wild's still the first one. You can just be so OP on this game, it's ridiculous. I'm just gonna do the finish up for the sake of it. Oh, it brings out a load of different ones. That's actually pretty nifty. Oh, okay, okay, you're not letting up then. Here we go. Oh, here's my counter shield. I've never used it before either. Oh, I've changed clothes as well. Like color of clothes. Nice. Oh, why am I getting so excited? It's a bit like Master Form. Kind of. This is OP as heck. You can't say this is not OP. This is ridiculous. Let's do the finish here. Why not? Oh, it brings out like Pegasus. <laughs> this is cool. So flashy, this game. It is so flashy. And now we do one of these. <laughs> Literally no time for normal combat. And that's how you do it. Okay. One more. Yeah, that was a lot going on. Hmm. What was that voice? Several times it can be I upgraded. It. Nice. I didn't hear it. You sure it wasn't the wind? Or something else? It was me talking. I'm pretty sure. Where'd they come oh. from? Get the ice cream later. Oh. Is it what? the... Hold on. Uh, what are their names again? See? Voices. It'd be those uh, thingy, Broxus' friends. New ones? It is as well. What? Hainer? Pence. That's their names. Olette. That's their names. <laughs> What is that? Again, I'll read everyone's comments after I've watched the cutscene. Hey! Sora. Yeah, he looks grown up. Hello, goodbye! Uh, oh. Go! We got this! Alright. This thing is literally everywhere. Like the thingy. How, what do you call this? Like a heartless train or something? Yeah. Holy crap, it's the demon tide. Look how many health bars it's got! This is going to take a while. Yeah, no, go crazy, yeah. I think this happened when we played 0.2 as well, the same soundtrack against this thing. Holy sugar. Rage form? Oh, it's thingy. It's this form. Nice. This actually works a little bit better than the last one, number two, I think. Oh, this is cool as hell. I bet you this is going to be a goddamn uh, handicap, though, like the other one was. I just love the air fighting. Wrist charge. Let's do what this does. See what this does, even. What in the heck is this doing? I have no idea. Finish. That is very nice. This thing has got so much health. And that's why it is. You don't need to defeat it. Okay. That was cool. I like that. Your rage form, whatever it was called then. Nice fighting. Thanks, Sora. 
Hayner, Pence, Olette. It's been ages. What? It hasn't been that long. Uh, it's rocks that's coming out of it, isn't it? Yes, hey. Donald, Goofy, how are ya? We're good. Howdy there, Olette. So does this mean that weird stuff's going down again? Are you kidding, uh. Pence? When have we ever seen a tornado of shadowy blobs before? Shadowy blobs. It's not weird. Is he wearing Crocs? This is unprecedented. Hmm, I guess it is. The creatures from the last time were bright white. These things must be new. Man, I can't oh, wait gross. to get to sleuthing. We're already done with the school project, silly. Whatever's going on, you wouldn't be here unless you had a good reason. Which is? Well, actually, we're looking they for Roxas. They don't remember him, though, right? Roxas? That's funny. I don't yeah, know any exactly. Roxas, but the name sounds familiar. Maybe we bumped into him somewhere. I really hope we do actually find him. I hope he's like the first Actually, person we find. he might have been friends with another version of you. Hmm? Ah, nice. This photograph. Yeah, we've got the same one. Oh, yeah, the other Twilight Town. It's like one of those spot the differences puzzles, except really easy. I guess in that town, we're friends with this Roxas person. Sora, let us help you track Roxas down. <laughs> really? Sure, he seems like a pretty He's got cool like guy. an X. An X, uh, thingy. Necklace. <laughs> yeah, he is. Great, then let's all go ask around town. If alternate us knew Roxas, then maybe alternate other folks did too. Mm -hmm. Sora, you three should go to the place in the photo. It's the old mansion. Mm -hmm. The three of us will cover places in town. All righty. Thanks. Oh, yeah. I got this phone thingy that takes pictures. This that, phone thingy that takes wanna pictures. Want to snap a photo while we're all here? Sure. That's oh, a great uh, idea. Can you take selfies in this? <laughs> oh, maybe not. <laughs> That's a full nail. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Wait, who's taking it? Oh. Mm. <laughs> Why do they need the two of them? Is he on his shoulders? Uh, no. Do do hey, tough luck. You drew the short straw. It's okay. Oh, I'm sitting out of the photo with you, Donald. Can you take the photograph? Oh, he's going in it. That's just harsh. <laughs> Everybody smile! <laughs> wow! That came out great! It's better than my camera phone. Oh, a lucky emblem! The Mickey emblem. Lucky emblem? Oh yeah, they are huge right now. Supposedly, these things are hidden all over town. Are these just collectibles And then? if you get a picture of them, they'll yes, bring you good luck. basically. Cool! <laughs> Wait, look guys! Is that? You're right. I see it too. Or is it? Yeah, of course. <laughs> I knew it. Good luck, because they're not all this easy to find. Okay. We found one in we the last place. Asking around. You start by checking out the old mansion. We'll catch up. Got it. Oh, it's there. Let's yes. See. There it is. Why the selfie? Okay. Nice, okay. AP boost as well. I you get AP you find boost. The next one. That's actually really handy. I'd know those ears anywhere. Yeah. You could make this game broken. The easiest game to get the secret end. Fair enough. Yeah, they are the best. I've missed them. It's been a while since we've been with them, so uh, yeah, I've missed playing with them. And apparently I can't get that fruit. Look at all the NPCs, this is mad. Okay, don't let me go up there then. I'm gonna miss so much in this game and I don't want to. I can just tell.
Doesn't let you go over there, though. Yeah. I think I know where they uh, were meant to be going, so... Is that Chinese yeah. food? Yeah. Why can I lock onto this? Aha, there you go. Chocolate, nice. It's mad how you can get ingredients. Yeah. So much to explore. It's mad seeing so many yeah. people. <laughs> oh, look yeah. at that. <laughs> nice. That's when we went to um, the old Mickey world. It's like an area down there. Yeah. The sewer, yeah, yeah, so I'm going the right way. <laughs> yeah, I bet you it does. Oh, it's this thing. Yeah, like this thing. This thing is O E to hell. I didn't realize I could just hold X as well. Okay, let's get through here. Let's get through here. Another chest. Please don't tell me I just come from this way. This leads me straight into the castle here. Usually I have to go through the woods, right? The woods is right here. Okay. All right, that's an interesting new way. Okay. Hey, amigo. Huh? He's been eating all the fruit. Hmm? What's that? Oh, great. More heartless. Heartless. Heartless monkeys what do you eating think the fruit. They're up to. I am enjoying it so far, mm. yes. I really am. It's ratatouille. Look, on that branch. The heartless the have him surrounded. <laughs> oh no. What's that? Yeah. <laughs> I've never seen ratatouille either. I've seen quite a lot of the Pixar films, so I've never seen that. I think I've got it downstairs. Little shit. Yeah. I know references from it. Oh, you can throw it as well? I mean, this is just OP as heck. What's the move called again where you throw your keyblade? That's basically what that is. But like a more uh, efficient way. Just look how OP you can be. Not it and this is only level one, not level seven or whatever it is, of this Keyblade. I don't like that camera angle too much. Is this count as an amusement? No, or it just counts as these Keyblade altogether? This is an amusement. I've not been on this one yet. You see, it's just ridiculous. It is just ridiculous. It literally keeps the stream there as well. Oh, nice! It's worth experiencing these all the first time, even if I don't like them later on, it is worth experiencing all. Yeah, this is a very fun game. This is a very fun game. Close your eyes for the finisher. Well, take care. Goodbye, little rat. He is so confused. Is he going to jump on one of them? Yes. Whoa! What? What is? Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> that would not work. Lucky, that little feller's parked on your head. Huh? Would you cut that up? Oh. I, I'm guessing this is what oh. actually happens in the film. 
to pull anybody's hat. Maybe he wants you to pick up the fruit for him. Okay, that's fine, but I can do it by myself. I just need to collect the fruit. It's cute. Right then. This is probably better animated than the actual film itself. So, what are you going to do with all this anyway? Chop it all up. Hmm? Oh. Well, okay. You be careful going home. See you around. Oh. I mean, he's got food. I'm sure we'll see him again. <laughs> it still makes me laugh that the, um, like Goofy and Donald are uh, speaking to me whilst I'm running around. Oh, come on. Give me a break. Oh, whoa. Whoa. Okay. Yeah, this is pretty dumb. Doesn't do a lot of damage, though. Alright, let's go. Yeah, that does give you motion sickness. Wow. I would like to have a go on that in real life. I really would. I've probably gone on something very like it before. The heck's happened to this guy? Level 9 already. Level 9. This is the first Kingdom Hearts 3 world. But yeah. Leveling up very fast. Mushrooms, I mean. Uh, I'm pretty sure you wouldn't want them. Why can't I get on this ledge? Get the chest. Get the chest, please. Jump on this. It... Am I just being dumb again? Why make them so hard to jump on? Don't tell me I need to jump off that tree. There you go. I don't see the purpose of those trees to navigate around when you can just run on the floor. Maybe just to do this, but... Okay, okay. We're going up there. I see it. Splash that Mountain. Up ah, I've never been to Disneyland or um, Paris. That is very interesting. Is they are these all off like uh, Disney rides? Are they? I will go there one day. I will go there one day. It is all for healing. You're pretty sure they are. They have been here before, so. Don't tell me Namine's still in there. Is she? Oh, he's getting... Oh! What do you think, guys? This place is even creepier than I remember. Well, they do say that this mansion is haunted. By a quiet blonde girl. <sighs> hey there. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the heart attack. Oh, what? Did I scare you? Uh, oh. <laughs> What's with the checkers in this game? Like, the checkers on everyone's clothing. So how did it go? Did you get any leads? <laughs> nope. Afraid not. The asking around thing was a total bust. Yep. This old mansion is our last hope. Alrighty. Okay. Okay. Nostalgia, yep. You guys ready? Another Twilight Town awaits. Yeah. Okay. 
There's some very good shots in this, like... That was another good shot of the, the gang, shall we say. Ah, here we go. Here we go! Has that got something loading on there? Oh, it needs a password. The password was... Uh, sea salt ice cream, right? Okay, Straight in I'm there. in. Let's get that transporter working. Uh, uh, Wasn't it smashed up? Or was that in the other world? Oh, man. The transporter's been protected. Protected from what? I guess from us? We can't use it to get to the other Twilight Town. Why not? Of course. It worked before. We sent Sora there. Well, that was then. And this is now. And there's no other way? None that I know. Great. There'd be a way. Uh, huh? The music. Hello, Sora. You wouldn't happen to be in front of a computer. How does huh? he know that? Well, yeah. But how do you know that? I was tinkering with Ansem's computer. You know, to decrypt the code that was left in it. And I noticed that someone had logged in from another terminal. I figured it might be you. How can this man see uh, anything? Oh, yeah, the log terminal. You don't know what you said. Oh, oh and what? You do? <laughs> I know. I haven't got a clue. It's like a movie, oh, this is. Then, uh, who was it that logged in? Oh, hi there. This is Pence. I'm the one who logged into the computer. Good. As long as it's a user that we know we can trust. Yup, but I'm kind of stuck here. Hmm. One of the programs is protected, so I can't uh, run it. Which program? This uh, guy's just gonna go. Transported to the other Twilight Town. Uh, it's the only way to find Roxas. You gotta help us. Another Twilight Town? I didn't and know about it. Transporter. Okay, a virtual town inside the computer made of data. Oh, not this again. Escape. Not another Tell data us. thing. Mm-hmm. We've seen one. That's what we used once to investigate Jiminy's journey. I like how they're still making recoded Maybe relevant. Maybe I can do something. Pence, let's get a network set up. My address here is... <sighs> Has it really been that long? <laughs> Okay, sharing is enabled. Is he doing it so we huh? can go on his computer? Were you able to fix it? Now that our two computers have been successfully networked together, I can take control of the terminal there yeah. and change the privileges. And Roxas? Yes. For the virtual world to be completely realized, Ansem the Wise would have included Roxas's full data in the construction. Meaning, somewhere on your machine there's a log of that data that... Uh, basically, we can decipher Ansem's code more quickly, and we can analyze the virtual Twilight Town while we're at it. Okay, great. This guy's surprisingly friendly, so and I thought he would be. Glad you're following along. Don't worry, we'll handle it. Chippendale will be helping me out here on this end. I'll call you back as soon as we know anything more. Thanks. Oh, before I forget, a bit of troubling news. It's about one of the organization's former members. Take you know him as Vexen. Oh no. But to us, he was Ansem's apprentice, Evan. Okay. He was recompleted like the rest of us. But hadn't regained consciousness yet. Then, sometime after Lee left, Evan vanished. Ooh. Alias and Dylan, the two you knew as Lexius and Zaldin, they went out looking for him, but he's I reckon just someone's gone. kidnapped him. And I'm starting to worry. Oh, you think he's on their side? Yeah. I think it's a real possibility. He's a devious researcher. You should be careful. He'd be really helpful to right. uh, Xehanort and stuff if they had him back on his side. Oh so no. he can like construct work. dolls and people I totally and stuff. Forgot. Really? But what about all this? Hey, both are important. We're gonna need some cash to go to the beach. God also, damn, not the beach don't again. Don't forget the pretzels. Gotta buy four now. What about the salty mm -hmm. ice cream? 
Uh... Oh, I get it. He's thinking ahead. <laughs> Later, Sora. Yeah, see ya, Hainer. Bye, Donald. Goofy. Goodbye! <laughs> oh, and since I'm manning the computer here, you guys are in charge of earning my share. No pretzel for pets. <laughs> Leaving them at a haunted mansion. Hey! Because <sighs> they all look really so, nice. You think you can bring Roxas back? Oh. <laughs> Hello, Anson. Oh. Anson! I'm not even shocked to see these Goodness. characters at this point. Roxas should never have existed in the first place. What you seek is impossible. Roxas does exist. His heart's inside my heart. And in the unlikely event you did manage to separate the two... I mean, you did. Where is it you think you can put his heart? Well, Roxas used to live in the other Twilight Town, right? So, I'm just gonna put him back there. Simple as that. Do you that. even realize what you are saying? The other Twilight Town is just data. A heart can live anywhere, even inside data. There are hearts all around us. It's quite sad mm. if he just lives on in data. Ransom and Zemnis used to be more. part of the same person, right? Exactly. But look, now they exist separately just fine. Exactly. If they can do it, then I don't see any reason why you and Roxas can't find a way. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you tell him, Captain Goofy. In that case, by all means, nothing would please us more than Roxas's return, of course. Yeah, because they want him as you another Xehanort. He'll never answer to you again. Still so blind, a nobody is what's left behind. When one gives his heart to darkness, there is only one way to bring Roxas back. Which is for you to give your heart up as well. Mm. Sora, have you finally decided to call upon the darkness? <gasps> I don't what? think so. Go on then. The shadows are never out of reach. <gasps> Okie dokie uh. then. <sighs> now. Set your heart free. Goofy big brains, Wait. as per usual. Zero! It's not darkness. Not if it helps him. I like how we're literally trying to get him back from the off. That's like really good. Considering he's probably maybe my favorite character, I reckon. Maybe. Definitely like top two. I think he is. I think he is. Well, if we do get him back, I hope we can play as him again. That'd be cool as heck. Very reminiscent. <laughs> I'm not keen on that camera angle. This is okay. Again, OP as hell. And again, OP as hell. Ooh, that one turned like a crocodile then. Magic teacups, why not? Let's go all out. Just so much goes on. They did put a lot in this game, to be fair to them. No wonder it took them so many years. So far, I can't see like why people are disappointed in this game. I know a lot of people do like it, but I can't see, like, anything disappointing yet. A lot of main story stuff's happening, so... It's not been any filler yet-ish, so... So far, so good, is what I'm trying to say. Deep in Fort Sora. Your favourite character, Gion, okay. He said, with all my heart. 
Okay. Then all my heart it is. I'm getting Roxas out. Are you with me? Donald? Goofy? Do you even need to ask anymore? <laughs> you bastard! You. I don't know what Ansem and Xemnas want, but I think we better tell the others to watch out. Okay then. Let's head back to town. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Well, bless what? my bagpipes. It was you yeah, I would, I'd like who to get that. rescued my chef. I can't go strong. Huh? I still don't understand why he's Scottish. Didn't he sell ice cream in Hollow Bastion? That's right. But Uncle Scrooge here is what you might call a world traveler. Cool. <laughs> Has he got some ice creams for us? How are you, Uncle Scrooge? Oh, hello, Sora. You're looking hale and hearty. I heard you were on another grand adventure with these two. I hope Donald isn't making I like a menace this of himself. Uh, why would you have to say that? So, Uncle Scrooge, what's that you were saying about a chef? Oh, right, uh oh, right. Ratsui. The chef of me bistro here wanted to show you his appreciation. So, he baked this for you. Oh, nice. Hmm. Is it a cake? What is it? Oh, wow. cake! Oh, he's under his hat. The whole cake? It's for us? Huh? I mean, uh, settle down. Uh, the chef wants you to know it's not a cake, but a tart of fruit. He does? A fruit cake? Why keep it under my hat? May I introduce Little Chef? Oh, oh it's you! I like how they're not offended that a rat cooked them food, it all but yeah. started a little while ago, when I was enjoying one of the best meals of my life. And when I asked to speak to the chef, I met this wee genius. As it turns out, I need to watch that film. he wanted to expand his culinary horizons. So I thought, that's an opportunity. And I financed the whole operation. Ooh, I think he wants to cook some more for you. Oh, is this what the ingredients some are for? Ingredients, especially ah, yes, unusual. now I get it. That'll be fun. Kind of like a scavenger hunt. And the more the better. The mark of a truly great chef is creating masterpieces out of anything. You can start what right here What does the food do to us then? Is it just like we'll a little box or something? We'll do anything to try more of little chef's food. <laughs> You haven't even tried that, that yet. That tart sure did look scrumptiously delicious. Okay, the ingredient hunt is on. Okay. Uh, yeah, nine ingredients, I've short. definitely got more now than let's that. keep searching. Oh, here's yeah. one. Little Chef needs more ingredients. <laughs> we better keep an eye out. Is this part of the main mission, is it? I have to do this. I thought he called me a muggle then. We can't <laughs> leave. Little Chef still needs our help. All right, where's the fruit baskets? I know there's chocolate and stuff. That counts as ingredients. Uh, you did, yes. Got a lot off that one. Aha, another one down here. Onion. Wouldn't you move like chocolate, whatever it was then? Um, people gotta eat. People gotta eat. Let's see if there's any more in here. No, there's no food in there. People must have eaten it already. Chocolate. I like how it's just random chocolate running around. This game reminds me of this level, like Mario Sunshine or something. This level, anyway. Where's some more? Haha. -ha. Three more. Three more. We can't leave. Little Chef still needs our help. I'm not trying to leave, Sora. I'm just trying to get to another place so we can find some more food. Any over there? Am I missing some? Is it only nine altogether, and I've actually have missed some? I don't know. 
Okay, let's keep my eyes peeled a minute. Aha, there's no chocolate over there. Okay, how we are. Right, two more, two more. Keep my eyes peeled. Have I been... I've been here. I hit that fruit there. Any more down here? Whoa. What's gonna happen next? Oh, uh. Duh, 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 duh. I want my ice cream myself. Yeah. One more now. One more. You would think someone would be outside the actual restaurant itself. Surely there's more than you actually need to get. Aha, here we go. Nice, there you go. A plate's on the roof. Oh. Ah, okay. Oh, we got more now. We got more now. Hey! Guys! Oh. Hey, Nerf. Don't mind us, we're just speaking to a rat. And a duck. Uh, hey, boss. Uh, Down with the posters. Uh -huh. Hi. Good work, kids. You guys work for Uncle Scrooge here at the bistro? Um, do we? He gave us a short job putting up these special posters. Mr. McDuck's hosting an open-air film festival in the courtyard. Ah, is that what oh, that huh? is? Yeah. With a QR oh, code on Sora. it. Hold your phone up to the poster. <laughs> As if they actually okay. are going to use the QR code. There, you've just downloaded a promo game for the film. Oh, you nice. You can try it later. Yeah, so you do do a mini game. Of course, laddie. Provide a bit of entertainment and then give folks a nice, cozy place to relax. Like my bistro here. They'll all be happy and hungry. And eager to spend their money. Oh yeah, <laughs> he wants the money. Uncle <laughs> Scrooge. So just oblivious still. Or oh, she sure is canny. I always wondered how he keeps customers coming into his businesses over and over. Oh yeah, I'm no business guy, but I sure wouldn't want to be one of Uncle Scrooge's competitors. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> oh. oh right. I need to warn you guys. Oh, right. Why? Well, those creepy crawly things might come back for more. So stay on your toes. Sure. But don't we have you guys to take care of them for us? We're not going to be around forever, look. You have to leave again? Mm-hmm. It's our job. But we'll definitely be back. When are you going to slow down? Sorry. Just do me a favor. Well, what is it? Don't make it too tough. I know how Roxas feels to be lost, but Donald and Goofy, Kyrie, brought me back by wishing with all their hearts. Mm. Oh. So I was hoping the three of you would do the same and wish for Roxas. They can't really remember what? him though. That's it? <laughs> That's no favor. We'll all wish. I'm wishing. Yeah. Me and Pence, too. <laughs> Thanks. I really hope he does come back. And of course, they're watching us. Oh, here we go. There's another one. Oh, it's Zigbar. Aren't you making it a little too obvious? We were instructed to guide him. Yes. Just look at them. They wouldn't get far if we did not spell it out. Hmm. Hmm. Fair hmm. enough. But let's not forget how many times Sora still managed to rain on our parade. If he wavers from the path we lay, we destroy him. But in that case, we'll have to find ourselves another vessel. I think that's what they're thinking that about Roxas is then. Why we never have just one iron in the fire. Something bad's gonna happen. Something bad's gonna happen. I reckon that's why they weren't like that hesitant about saying, yeah, just bring Roxas back then if you want to. It's gonna benefit them. I think that's what's gonna happen. I don't know. Or it might.
I'm sorry I left without saying goodbye. Did Master Yen Sid tell you? The Kairi or... I'm training to become a Keyblade yes. wielder like you. Here we go, okay. That's right. No more waiting for you to come back from your adventures. I want to get out there and do my part to help. Oh, good on you, Kairi. Merlin has used his magic to bring us to a place where oh. time doesn't matter. Show me Lee. We can take as long as we need to complete our training. Whoa. He's an amazing wizard. T time doesn't matter? The hyperbolic time chamber? Oh, and by us, I mean me and Lee. He's really sorry for all the trouble he caused. I told him it's fine, but he won't stop apologizing. I'll admit I was a little scared of him at first, but I've gotten to know him better. Yeah, he's a nice guy, really. All he ever wanted was to help his friend. Honestly, it's hard not to like him. Show me him. Show me him. Every now and then, I catch him staring at me. When I ask what's wrong, he says, I'm not sure. I think I'm forgetting something. Oh, he's thinking about she. Don't ah, he's remembering her. Sora, I think it may have something to do with you. Nice. Your journey is all about helping people. Some that you've never met before. And some like Lee that you have. They're all counting on you. It still it feels like it's an intro. Easy, but I hope you'll remain the happy and cheerful Sora I know. There's no heart your smile can't reach. Oh damn, this is so good looking game. Whoa, look What's at wrong? him! Huh? Uh, nothing. Sorry. His hair looks even more Wait. crazy. What? I am. <laughs> it looks really cool. A letter? Yep. To Sora? Mm, technically, yes. But I won't send it. It's more for me. Ask Merlin. He'll deliver it for you. Yeah. But it's okay. Why is he still staying I in the like clothes? Talking to Sora, <laughs> even if it's on paper. Huh. Okay. He seems a lot more innocent. Oh. Hmm? Here. Where the hell Ice is he pulling from? Really? Yeah, I asked Merlin to pick these up. You know, we did both summon Keyblades. Gotta celebrate. You're sweet, Lee. <laughs> nah. He does love that ice cream, though. I mean, I don't know how it didn't melt in his pocket, but yeah. What? He's remembering. He's remembering, nothing, sort of. Nothing. I just... You're trying to remember what you forgot? Well, I, uh... Yeah. Yeah. So tomorrow... You and me in the ring. You ready? Please let me play as these characters, please. Don't hold back, Lee. Promise? Mm. Oh. oh, yes, see? See? Huh? Oh, no. Are you okay? Lee? Uh, yeah. Sorry. I don't know how you could bring her You're back, crying. though. What's wrong? Uh, something in my eyes. Lee. I'm gonna go. Sorry. Okay, but stop apologizing. Fine. On one condition. What? Call me Axel from now on. Oh, cool. Got it. Memorized? Yeah. Okay, Axel. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's screw the ice cream, though. <laughs> that was a very nice scene. That was very nice. Axel. We can just call him Axel now, then, rather than Lee.
looks really cool. Like his hair is everywhere and it's 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 cool. Not to say it wasn't usually, but it's just in this graphics. This is basically where you fought. So uh, this is the place. Aqua and Terra fought. Where Aqua fell into the realm of darkness after she dove in to save Terra. Yeah. She said he was acting strange. Strange how, exactly? She sensed darkness in him. And they ended up getting into a big fight. Keep on forgetting they don't know. Right. They don't know, do and they? And in the aftermath, the two of them disappeared. Around the same time, the guards found a stranger with white hair lying unconscious here in the square. A man calling himself Xehanort. Ansem the Wise took the stranger in, but that was a mistake. Xehanort betrayed his master, stole his research, and along with his fellow apprentices, separated his heart from his body. Yep. Xehanort's heart took his master's name, Ansem, and traveled to the past to give his younger self instructions. Jesus he Christ, yeah. He briefly had control of you. His empty body stayed in the present, took the name Xemnas, and founded Organization 13. Their goal was to prepare 13 vessels for Xehanort's heart. This is a lot more simpler Until way of explaining it. an end to the organization. But all the while, young Xehanort had been visiting the future to choose 13 vessels of his own. Jesus. Hearts with strong enough ties to him to begin a new organization. The real Organization 13. And now they're looking for a fight with us. That's but what happened to Terra? I thought you said that Aqua saved him. Yep, she did. The problem is we didn't notice. You remember the end of the Mark of Mastery exam? When Master Xehanort made his grand return? That's the Xehanort I remember. He was already a pretty old man then. But how do you explain Ansem and Xemnas, his heartless, and his nobody? Isn't it strange how young they look? Why aren't they old men? It's because Xehanort was using a different body when the split happened. That face from the portrait I mentioned? Oh. It wasn't just some stranger that oh, Ansem the Wise click? took under his wing. It was the young man whose body Master Xehanort possessed. No way. That was Terra? Master Xehanort was using Terra? Yup. Master Xehanort told us another on our list belonged to him. He was talking about Terra. Turns out, Aqua saved more than just her friend that day. Okay, but Master Xehanort is an old man again now. Where did Terra's body go? Hmm. <gasps> it's cause Master Xehanort's collecting vessels! He claimed to have two of our seven lights. We got Sora back, but Terra must still be on Xehanort's side. He's with Organization 13? We should warn Sora. Yup! Okay. And Merlin too! Okay. Yeah. Got a tiny bit of confusion at the end there, but I think I get it. We already knew what, mm, hey, all that anyway. That was a nice refresher, though. That was a good way to explain it all in one. We're going to Toy World. We're going here. I, I got a feeling I know what this is going to be. Okay, yeah, we're, we're, we're just keep, we'll keep the main ship for now. Oh no. What the heck's that? What the hell is this? A guardian? Oh come on, they don't need this so straight away. This why is this thing solid? I'm not doing any damage to this thing. How do I end it? Get me out of this. I'm surely not meant to be here now. Ah, okay. I can abandon it. I'm just not doing a lot of damage to it, that's the only thing.
I could be here all day doing this. How the heck do I abandon this thing? This is taking a while. Seems like I need to have a look for this. Oh, abandon the battle. There you go. Okay. I would have been there all day doing that. I'll go back to it. Don't worry. I'm not just going to abandon everything. Look how amazing this looks. You can now walk to the new location. Okay. I'm... Oh, hello. Are you kidding me? I've just come all this way for this. You meant to be some Emperor Zerg impersonator here, or... I mean, this one's got less health than the last guy I fought, so that's okay. Still taking a goddamn while. Try and get a uh, celestial scan in one of them that gives you an OG gummy shin. Alright, okay. Yeah, if I see any, I'll, I'll do it, don't worry. It's a lot more easier in fights than this, I've noticed. I can literally don't even have to look though, that's the funny thing. Do at least favour how long it takes. I'd say Kingdom Hearts 1 is the worst. Yes, I would say that. Number 2 wasn't the worst, to be honest, with the gummy ship. It wasn't the worst. Or oh, it just wasn't this. No. It gets better after messing with the gummy ship, otherwise I'd probably agree. Yeah. The, that's what annoyed me. When I played Kingdom Hearts 1, I tried to edit my gummy ship and I got confused doing that. It did. What we get off that then? An, a B rank, or I'll take it. What the hell is this? What in the Noctus is this? What in the world? This is an advert? That is Noctus. Verum Rex. That was an advert. <laughs> what the heck was that? That was cool as sh Oh. I was watching that. Uh, sorry. I thought I came into the this wrong world. This is no time for television, Rex. Gotta say that Giga's pretty impressive. Really? Rex. I like you so almost. <laughs> Rex and Ham's voices are the same. Is that, Woody, what gives? Is that Tom Hanks? Are they back? Shh. All right, guys. Today we teach those mask intruders who's boss. Is don't everybody think so. in position? Wait, hold on. I don't think I'm emotionally prepared. Oh. Would you calm down? Don't worry. I got you covered. Is that Tim Allen for the balls, though? Yeah, it kind of sounds like him, um, Woody, it's so... Go time. Yes. Yes. I freaking love Toy Story. We're in Andy's, um, room, though. So that makes me say that it takes place in number two or the beginning of number three. Is this Andy's room? What in the world? 
Where are we? <laughs> hmm? Oh my gosh! Have we been shrunk? And... and look at us! You know what the magic is for? We have to protect the word order! Border? I said order! Gorge! They look cool like little figures. Who's gonna protect the order from them? Heartless! Nice. Okay. We go on three. Yeah, the music. The music. One. Two. Ah. Wait. Between what two and three. What are you doing? Who are those guys? All oh, right, let's do this. I haven't tried my uh thingy blade yet. This is so fun. It's just really fun. The music as well, like it's it's cool. If you ever need to be happy and play a game to make you happy, that I'm this to be the game. This this is so fun. It's not stressful yet. And there's so much you can do. Imagine the toys just looking down at this. They must be like, what in the world? Woody and Buzz are just like, what in the heck is going on here? Lightning from the sky? I know they probably can't see that from before, you know. Wait! Oh, oh, you look familiar! Huh? I know this! What? You're... Uh, uh, you're... Uh... You're Zora! Huh? How the hell do they know My him? name's Sora. Oh. <laughs> Stay back. For all we know, the intruder said... Yeah, Zora! Yeah, Zora! Uh, Is that who was there, on the Rex. telly, then? We don't know them. But we can trust them! Yeah. They're the number one selling heroes in the country! Oh, they do yeah. think they're the ones on and the telly. Mom must have bought them for them! Ham's right! Did you see how easily they took care of the intruders? Well, they don't I like new toys. I bet to figure out why all our friends have gone missing. And why Buzz's laser started actually lasering. And had all the weird stuff that's been going on. I mean, that's what heroes do, right? Let's not jump to conclusions. Hmm. Gotta be smart, Woody. That is, that's Tim Allen, that, isn't it? Yeah. So you're Andy's new toys? Toys? <laughs> You sure did a number on those intruders. Those are the heartless. The bad guys. We've been fighting against those intruders for a while. I knew it! <laughs> hmm. Okay. Huh? In that case, you're all right by me. My name's Woody. Put her there. Hey. Now hold on. I'm Sora. Yes, Sora! <laughs> I love rats. Actually, my name's Sora. Well, I'm Goofy. And I'm Buzz Lightyear. Call me him. It's a real honor. And I'm Rex. I'm your biggest fan. In fact, I've been playing your game for months now. It's like and reminiscence of when he was playing the, the to Toy Story, uh, the uh, but that Buzz game. Comet boss is really tough. Number two. Slinky and I can't figure out how to beat him. Oh, I wish Slinky and the others were here. They'd be so happy to meet you. All troops, at mm -hmm. attention, sir! Let me guess, they couldn't get their voice <gasps> actors in. Strangers. Oh, no. From the no. outside. <laughs> Welcome. They're all toys? So that's why we look the way we do. Huh? Excuse me. You said that you've battled those intruders before. Tell us where and why. Oh, well, uh, we are... No. Ah, ah! oh. Well, you must have come from somewhere. Hmm. Take it easy, Buzz. What matters is that they got those intruders out of our way for at least a little while. No need to interrogate them. Yeah, Buzz. Woody's right. Noted. But still. Hey, mm -hmm. have those intruders 
The Heartless been a problem around here? No, they just showed up a little while ago. Basically following In you, fact, Yazora. Those Heartless materialized right after all of our friends up and vanished. You don't think. Well, gee, it can't just be a coincidence. Mm. It wasn't always this lonely. One day we woke up and we were the only toys left here. Nobody's heard from Mom, Molly, or Andy. Oh. We keep waiting for Andy to come home. You really care about him. It's funny if you just appeared as like a normal human, you actually got to play the yeah. toys with Andy. <laughs> He's the best friend that toys like us could ever hope to have. All right, we better start looking. Huh? Have you got any clues we can go on? Any other strange things that happened? Well, hmm. Hmm. Do you get to explore the whole There's house? one thing. <laughs> one big thing? Huge, sir. What thing? After everyone went MIA, the intruders didn't come alone. They arrived with a guy wearing a hood dressed in black just like you. As a uh -oh. matter of fact, he's the only other toy we've seen outside of you three. A toy they and all. But that would mean the organization. Toy organization. You know who it is? <laughs> yeah. They're bad news. Seems like you have a lot of enemies. We may have a hunch what's causing all the weirdness. The music in the background. Would you mind if we handle this? I'm sorry. But we're not going to leave this to you. Huh? If that guy had something to do with our friends vanishing, then he's our problem too. We've got to work together. <laughs> right. <laughs> so then, where can we find that guy? Sarge, any word from the recon team? The latest reports place him in town, sir, at Galaxy Toys. In town? Then Galaxy Toys is where we're going. Sora, mm -hmm. follow me. It's out the window and down the roof. Not so fast, cowboy. Hmm? You seem pretty gung-ho about going. But shouldn't we stay here and wait for Andy? Well, you've got a point, but... Won't be that first adventure. We've tried waiting. Look, if we go with Sora, we might find a clue. Are you with me, Buzz? <laughs> Of course. Okay, let's move out. We have to get to the toy store. All right. Oh, look, trainers. Now this. Does the bed move when I jump on it? Oh, it's the little things. It's the little things. I literally, before I started playing Kingdom Hearts, I went through, um... <laughs> Blue Story 2, yes. like the game on PS1 again, and this is bringing back memories of that. Alright, let's get out that window then. Please, okay. Yeah. Happy the area, nice. Okay, knew that was going to be that anyway. Let's go. I haven't tried the shooting star yet. Ooh! I'm not trying that pirate ship. That pirate ship's annoying. If I use magic in this, will it go better? Oh, okay, okay. Doro arrow guns. Whoa, look at this! This is cool, the Kimbo in. Magic launcher. Whoa! Back off. Okay, the first thing we've got to do is head down the street. Look at this thing. Is on the other side of town.
I remember playing Toy Story 1 on PS1 back in the day. It was Toy Story 2, I'm pretty sure it was. I don't think number one was on it. It's Toy Story 2, I think. I'm pretty goddamn sure, hey, so anyway. I think the trampoline will take us back to Andy's room. We don't need to go back to Andy's room yet, though. Yeah, I'm pretty sure number one wasn't on it. I might be wrong. But I'm pretty sure it's called Toy Story 2 Buzz Lightyear to the Rescue. I mean, I, I'm quite sure because I played it the other day, but... Trinity one? What's this? Oh, it's just like a pure guard. Alright, okay, let's get out of this. I, I, I've played Toy Story 3, um, but I never ever completed it. I, I had it on the Xbox 360, I think, but I didn't really do much of it. But yeah, they're fun games. Looks like these. Fun. Apart from number, number two on the PlayStation 1 is a stressful game, actually. That's a stressful game. Like, the camera angles on that are ridiculous. And it's hard. It's literally hard. There's a video of me on my YouTube just playing it for about 20 minutes, but it's a hard game. Platformer. It's a sure proper platformer, though. Where am I going? Oh my god, I'm going to go in the street. We don't look, we look the daycare. Yeah, I think, I can't remember what you start off on number three. I think you start off in like the little, uh, where you're doing like a, a play or whatever it is. Where you're playing as like a thing is with ham and stuff. I think I still prefer the, um, Keyblade we got from, uh, first, this one. Not that one, this one. I think I still prefer this one. Where the heck? This place is massive. Galaxy Toys. You've never seen this place. Ah, uh, activating flow motion. Okay. Hey, why doesn't that toy move? I guess it hasn't figured it out. Figured what out? I can make it move for you. Uh huh? Oh, hello there. You're from the dream! The first of the Xehanorts! I'm so honored you remember me. Oh, he's not a toy, though. Uh-oh. Oh. oh, they're big. Oh, no. He can move. Way cool. Look out! Wow. He's gonna break the piggy bank. <laughs> One heart's shadows fill the emptiness of another. See how they bring him to life? Like heartless and nobodies, they fit together. Enough! Why are you doing this? There's a darkness we are missing and must reclaim. The way hearts connect in this world can provide us with a clue. So we made a copy of the world, and then pulled those hearts apart. Mm -hmm. I wonder how you'll handle the strain. Okay. Wait, what does that mean? Yeah, I was thinking Don't that. Don't let me down. Goddamn young Zeno. Well. <laughs> no! Woody, what is going on? Is this toy a friend or foe? I think we've got our answer. Yeah, he's trying to beat you up. <laughs> Yeah! If the Heartless know how to do it, there's no reason you can't! Oh? Do what? Get in one of them? Huh? <laughs> Alright! Brilliant! I'm on it! Okay! Yeah. Giggas, yeah! Alright! Oh my god, it's first person, like, shooting. Punch it. All right, yes. You would think the blue ones would be on our side, but okay. Danger dash. Get some. Is this Titanfall? <laughs> this is Titanfall. <laughs> Exploders. Get back down. 
I did not expect this. I did not expect this. The way, like I said, you can be just so OP in this game, this is another thing. Oh, and my health's running low. If I die in this, do I die? Or do I just jump out? Jesus Christ, you're getting back up. This reminds me of the scene of Pac-Man World Adventure 3. I've never played it, I'm sorry. Oh, so it's just a special move, that one. Okay. I'm going to want to eject in a minute. Holy crap, there's loads of these. Let's check. Back to the old fashioned way. Oh, you can get those to go in as well? Oh no, it's Ford, sorry. I thought it said Donald. Yeah, check when I'm low on HP. This one not move. This one is stuck. Is that more? Ah, I see ya. I don't know why I'm not trying to get another one. I think I just prefer doing this. I mean, you can stop running away a minute. Yeah, I need to get one of them, don't I? I need to get one of them. You just straight do this. This one didn't move a minute ago. Now it does. Okay. Nice. That was fun. This makes the, the levels be a lot more unique. Hey, Andrews. He was being controlled? He wasn't just switched into battle mode by accident? Buzz? It's nothing. I'm confused. Hmm? That guy in the black coat, did he say he made a copy of the real world? What's that mean? It probably means they split this world in two. Your friends in one world, us in the other. Ah. Only one of the worlds is real, and the other is just really convincing. You can't be serious. At Twilight Town. Oh, that's right. You're from a video game. <laughs> I was about well, to say he's not, but yeah, game, he is. That's how things work. But here in reality, you can't split worlds. Huh? Well, this is ridiculous. No. <laughs> I... Woody, let's go. I admit, it does sound just a little far-fetched. But, say we have been taken to some kind of alternate world. That would explain why your laser's real. And is it really that crazy? Worse than evil emperors and protecting the galaxy? Any of that ring a bell? <clears throat> yeah, number one. Point taken. But that just means these strangers are part of the delusion. And I say it's time we parted ways and went home. Thought we were on, friends, boss. not strangers. Look, I get that it seems weird. But we know something's wrong with this place. We should stick together. Sora's right. They helped with the intruders. So they might help find our friends. They have been there for us so far. You can't deny that. Come on. Every toy deserves a fair shake. Am I right? Tell it to fair that shake. toy over there. <gasps> hmm. Sheriff, sir! Huh? Rex has just been dino napped! Oh no! What's that? Oh, oh Rex! My men saw him get hauled up to the second floor, sir! And Ham and the aliens are MIA! 
Come on. We have got to find them. Please let us help. Yeah. Come on, Buzz. Well, Buzz, do you really think we can save our friends on our own? We didn't get very far before. We got to take all the help we can get. Don't worry. Hmm? Sora can be reckless, uh -huh. and Donald grumbles a lot. It's true. Right. But you can trust him. I suspect you do. It's true. Was it being very the same as Woody was in Toy Story 1? <laughs> See, they don't seem bad. Am I right, Buzz? Okay, fine. We do need the extra help. But just so we're clear, I remain skeptical about this. I'll work with you till we find our friends. Okay. Come on, boys. Thanks for the help, you know. Sora, Donald, Goofy. Is yes, Sora. Our troops will return to the field, oh. sir. You're getting kidnapped. This ascent is going to be rather tricky. I wonder if you can Too actually fly in this one. Strapped to a rocket, huh? <laughs> hey, think we could use that? Oh. That looks like you're going to be it's able to zip perfect. around that. Come on, guys. Oh, you can actually go with the prize machine. Okay. This looks like a way in. Ooh, aww. Nice. Map Galaxy Toys. Oh. Ooh, hello. Mm. Three rails. Yeah. And each one leads somewhere different. Oh, let's go on the green one. Oh, crap. I was pressing square, I've been playing Sonic. What a big world. Looks it's bigger than it looks, I mean. Yeah. Aha, we got another one of those, okay. For the mini game. The music gives it uh that extra bonus. Oh scary. They like bionicles. Well, the ones on the wall were. Is that a damn dinosaur? Where'd he go? You sure you saw him? I yes. seen a dinosaur. He just. Shh. Do you guys hear something? Hmm. I think this game's been designed really well. Something feels wrong. Holy crap, look at the size of the guy. Holy crap, he looks cool as hell. Buzz, he looked worried for a minute. If it wanted to play nice, then it should have stayed away from my friends. Come on, get the laser on there, Buzz. I have not done any links with these characters yet. The size of his hands. Oh, there's two of them. My mech would come in handy now. Definitely want to use the gigas for these enemies. Don't you worry about it. We don't need gigas for these enemies. Look at them. We're rinsing through them. Who needs gigas when you've got... Okay, I haven't got that anymore. The Gookie Bomber. We want to use the Gigas for this, I reckon. I reckon we want to use the Gigas for this because... Yeah. Yeah, this is definitely much more helpful. Holy crap. Yeah, this is better. You just feel too OP in this, though. I mean, I know I'm going to die in a second, but... Let's 
Let's go and get another one. Can you go up here and get some different ones? No, you can't. Dude, just type it be me, yep. Yeah? Oh, see this coming? There you go. Straight in the back. I just got speed slash as well. Whatever that is. There's no end to these guys. <laughs> oh no. He's such a dopey character. <laughs> I do. Oh, I love Rex. It's funny. Nice moves, Rex. Yeah, he meant to do great. that. Great, really? Would you say I was impressive? Very impressive, Rex. We couldn't look away. Hooray! Oh, that makes me so happy. Were you watching too? Did you see what I did? I was going to hear some, Listen, but I think Rex, I might have actually achieved you... something close to Earth to Rex. Do you funny. know where the others were taken? Looks like Neo Bam. It does actually. What do you mean? Did something bad happen? Back to square one. Oh, great. Huh? The soldiers. Sarge, have you got a status report? Sir, one of my men just located Ham, forward of our position, in babies and toddlers. Oh, no. <sighs> the corporal was debriefing him, but something must have gone wrong. All radio contact has been lost. <sighs> Anything more specific we can go on? Right before I lost contact, I heard music with some sort of sonic interference. Music? You think it could be the Heartless? What if it's another big monster? Let's find out. I agree. This actually well, it's brilliant. I think I'll head back and wait by the entrance. I'm sure those vents are going to be much too narrow for my big dinosaur tail. Just take it off. Really? I'm sure you'd fit. Rex is right. Besides, we need a lookout at the entrance. It's an important mission. Can you do it? Yes, sir. His arms. <laughs> 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 you know what I would find funny in this? If Rex comes back now with like one of their dinosaur arms, like one of these arms, and he comes around with one of them, that'd be funny. 